All right, that's it. Today we're gonna do one concern e west. I almost said east, which would have been stupid, but you know, uh, we're doing west because west is significantly better than east in all instances. Anyways, not the biggest fan of the east. Me. Hold on, I'm only at 83 completion here. That's total. Oh my gosh. Hold the phone. That's total completion. I don't know how it took me that long to figure that crap out. Because that's like, not even... Like, it says that on the freaking uh, save select screen. 83%. 83% is actually total completion. Wonderful. So, the map doesn't actually help me at all. <laughs> Great. Whatever. Not that I really care about completion in this game, as I've said the past five episodes, and I'm going to say it again. You can get at most 99% completion. Super epic. So, whatever. I don't even care anymore. Um, we're just going to do it. Okay? Wow. Okay. It's too silly about that one. Real silly. Oh my gosh. Uh. What did you go to do car accident and I can't move it, move it anymore. Uh, I know I'm hilarious. So, god, what was I even going to talk about today? I don't know that I ever have anything interesting to say regardless. So, you know, you're welcome. I'm just going to keep my mouth shut for this episode. We're just going to get into the tower. We're going to go through it, find all of the interesting things, and then we're going to end the episode. That's going to be the whole dang thing, because, in all honesty, what else am I supposed to say? For now... Honestly, I might I might actually wanted to start when I was in the tower, because it's not like this is the most fun place to traverse. Seriously. Hey, a corpse. Nice. We already knew what happened to those guys. We beat the corners a while back. And now that Fitzroy's out of the picture, I actually have nothing else to do but, like, collect stuff here. Um, and then collect stuff somewhere else next episode. And then fight a boss. That's actually it. So, yeah. For now. Wouldn't it be cool if this area opened up a lot easier after, um, being beaten? That would be epic. That would be super cool. I would appreciate that a lot. Um, oh well. You know that, that, it's kind of the case, but not really. I don't remember how to get in there. I'll get in there, don't, don't worry. I'll leave you me, but, like, I don't remember how. It has something to do with this elevator, I'm sure. Never mind. Actually, hold on. Okay, this might, this might have screwed me, because the other elevator is right on the side here. Or not, this middle area is completely quarantined, I forgot about that bit. Mm. Come on, can't elevators have a call button? You see it right there. Just give me a call button for the elevators so that I can actually use them effectively. Uh, but that's never gonna happen. Take me up. No? Great. Like I said, this place is just super fun to traverse. A puzzle in and of itself, just getting around. But hey, at least that means that the chests are relatively easy to pick up, because if they weren't, I would actually have no means of getting anything. Go for the very top, then. Maybe I'll even cut that entire earlier portion out, because I honestly don't quite know exactly what's going on here. There's a lot of corpses. Woods! Wow, let's see here. Mother by East Woods. Wow. Interesting. Anyways, none of my concern, though. I have 99 concerns, and this, while being one concern, is not one of my concerns. I know, I'm just great. Anyways. It's sure convenient for everyone. Okay, wonderful. This is what I mean by I wish there was a call button. 
here to find the friggin' other elevator. It's, it's not even a, a seek and find kind of thing, because I know exactly where it is, but to actually go get on it now. Well, hell, is this even a way to get to it? I believe so. Probably. Save the game, even though there's literally nothing in this entire building, except for corpses and me. Like, honestly, is there even anything that does damage in here? I want to say I remember the answer being no. But hey, there's an elevator. I'll take the elevator. That the heck I will... Anyways. Right, yes. I'm, in fact, going the right direction. All that matters... I'm going the right way. Oh, wonderful. I can't even get up here. Yes, I can. Great. Okay. See, there's something there, and there's something on the other side. And I just gotta be able to get down into them. There's honestly no reason for me to be unable to do that, because, I mean, there's nothing even here anymore. Check that crap out, yeah? Ivory oil, my friends! I can actually make crap now. Which actually, the other day I did, um... Oh, cool, actually. A tweak. I made... I made up some of the... Well, hold on. I'm sure it shows up in collection. Yeah, I made some of the uh, tweaks that I didn't have yet. Including detonator and, like, random... Error. Penetration. Interesting. I hope that, that gives piercing, because that's actually something I would like. Then again, what would he... Did I really never do that? What would it even get piercing to, right? Because... Usurper Gun already does piercing, and I don't know how well piercing would go with the stun gun, because it, uh... What am I saying? Because the stun gun, uh, homes on enemies, so it would be weird to have piercing on it, because it would require that the enemies be already aligned. In which case, I might even benefit more just from using the Usurper Gun anyways. That kind of deal. Or if this is a shortcut. I'm gonna hope yes and just go with it. Yes! Not that it really matters. Whatever. Is there even a, a Chemico Tape? How is my progress still 83%? I just picked up two chests, my friends. There is a Chemico Table. Way the heck out of the way, but there is one. I'm gonna go do that and I'm gonna check the tweaks because I honestly don't know what to do now. And behold, the one lone chemico table in the entire building. Uh, wavy beam. Oh, yeah, wavy beam. Wavy beam's not bad. Of course, penetration is wavy beam. You know. Next time I'm fighting something, I might actually do that. Well, hell, if the Usurper Beam shots... Well, it's just, it's just the Beam shots, actually. Because the Usurper Beam probably doesn't actually pass through walls. The tweaks, just for the hell of it. I'm going to equip these, though. I'm more interested in moving fast than being able to jump twice. That doesn't actually help me, because... There's pretty much nothing in this game you can't access without... ...being able to jump twice, anyways. Like, I guess it would help for things like that, but, uh, not actually having trouble with getting up anywhere anymore. <sighs> um, quick shoot up the wall, at the ceiling. I'm gonna figure this crap out, alright? Okay, I'm gonna be completely honest when I say this. I know I was just talking about how, um... I can access everything without double jump, and uh, I'm just now realizing, remembering, this is the way up to where I want to go, right? So, one. Ah! I was wondering if that worked. <laughs> there we go. All that for freaking technium. Waste of my time. Anyways, we did it, guys. I've still got featherweight anyways, which it's good that I did that now instead of later, because I wouldn't have been able to do it later. 
or I could have done it later, but it would have been a waste of my time. Be wasting my time. So, you know, that's what y'all are for. You're to waste your time instead. So, anyways, I think. I mean, I might as well go ahead and pick up the one thing at and Islugar. So, I'm gonna go do that, and then I'll end the episode. Because honestly, I don't actually remember what all I even left in One Concern East. Um, oh wow, we made it! Anyways, I also gave myself Wavy Beam for no reason, but you know, it'll be really cool. Now I can do things like this. That honestly helped me out just a little bit. Okay, hold on. Hold on, I gotta actually do this right. It's up and wrench. Right. There we go. Heck yeah. And that opens it up from the right? Yes. Very nice. I'm very good at what I do. So let's do that cool thing I learned earlier. Never mind. Can't do it here. God, I really did just get done saying that Featherweight wouldn't help me anywhere. Maybe I should have taken the motion between. I refuse. Sucker. Hey, Wavy Beam's helping me out more than Featherweight ever could. Just because I could have skipped this entire area by doing Featherweight doesn't mean that I regret my decisions at all. I don't. Because regretting decisions is for... Um, stupid people, and I am very smart. So smart, in fact, that I'm gonna do this crap again. Yep, see? Excessively intelligent. Metallium. Again, I really wish they would give me something a bit better for my effort, but whatever. On the next episode, we're gonna be taking on One Concern East, and then I will finally actually be going after the big bad of the game. Yep. There is one last big bad, one that we haven't even been so much as introduced to. Well, I guess the worm, we did see the worm. Um, yeah. Oh, okay. What the heck? Is it based on... Well, now I'm just confused. I've got the star now. Did I leave anything in East? You know, it's fully possible that I actually got all the chests. And that the last 12% is the last boss. Hell, I don't know. We'll find out on the next episode. Until then, like, comment, and subscribe, or I'm going to beat you over the head with a wrench. Goodbye! Yeah, I hope that one. I thought it was pretty funny.